And here we go. This tag team match is going to be heated, to say the least. Look at this. A suplex. Russian leg sweep. Oh, 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 perfect form. Oof. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bachwinkel, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes. The Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Beautiful technique. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, The New Day, The Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus. I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. But I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week and conquer a variety of opponents. To see the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior go from unwilling partners to WWE Raw Tag Team Champions was truly impressive. Big backdrop. A knee drop. Submission time. She better do something fast. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. Nailed it. Boom! <laughs> In comes the Miz. She's so close. Look out. There's the tag. And that changes the entire outlook for these women, Michael. Oh, what impact. Our truth in trouble now. But she knew this match wasn't... We've got to call down. The 2017 Elimination Chamber match for the WWE Championship saw an incredible array of superstars enter the chamber. And each one had a history with the other in some form or fashion. The Miz was in there against Bray Wyatt. AJ Styles, John Cena, Baron Corbin, and Dean Ambrose. Hooked up. Uh, inverted suplex. That hurt. The Hollywood A-lister was the last superstar to enter the unforgiving steel structure. Here, oh, lie detector. Hey, Byron, what's up? But can she follow up? She kicks out of that one. Not yet. When she gets in attack mode, look out. She's countering nicely now. Yeah, a second ago, she was almost done. Oh, the reversal by R-Truth. Irish whip. Ooh, what impact. Harsh impact. Takes her down. Wow, nice move right there. Oh, man, right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. 
Axe handle finds the mark. R Truth clearly out of his element here. You can see her partner wants to get oh, tagged in here. I just can't pick a winner at this point, guys. Any one of these women can take this thing. This might be it. Oh, my. There's the switch. Carmella is in. Double team effort and a neck breaker. Locked in. It's locked in. The damage has been done. There it is. Now the question is, can Carmella finish? In a tag team contest, a superstar. And she escapes the submission. Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. Take a look at this man. The Miz is a person the little children in this arena should look up to. I mean, you should look up to him as well, King. Uh, Boom! What impact! Oh, oh, it's over! This is off. Awesome. She's a superstar on a mission. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner. Oh, there's a kick to the midsection. Here we go! Oh, sliding hip attack. She has got to take advantage here. And look at hung up on the second. Get in there, ref. If you remember, guys, Carmella's introduction to the main roster came in 2016 when she was the final pick in the WWE brand extension draft. Now oh, this one's all but over. It's locked in. We could see a tap out. It's locked in. He's back in full control now. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. And that's a huge tap-out victory there. With wins like that, there's no way these two should even think about splitting up. Just my opinion. Hope you set your DVRs, folks, because that match is worth going back and watching again.